Being able to reclaim a habitat like this is not only benefiting sagebrush itself, it's also benefiting all of those other organisms that depend on it. And so that's really important to reclaim entire habitats. And the only real choice that we have is to do it at a landscape scale. This area was the Andrea Hunter mine. It was mined in the 1950s for uranium. This was once a big open pit where we're standing. And so Wyoming DEQ with BLM have come in and reclaimed this. And they did a great job revegetating it. But what you can see is that there's not very much sagebrush here. And so that's why we're planting here today. The goal is to restore the landscape to the way it was before it was mined. And we, you know, we do a lot of work with the soils and uh, drainage areas. But the revegetation is the last component that is probably one of the most important components. This is our Sagebrush in Prisons project where we have inmates grow sagebrush for us and then they even get to plant them on uh, some of our old mine sites around the state. Research on ecological programs in prison settings have shown that recidivism rates reduce drastically when inmates are learning about ecology and are participating in ecological programs. Trying to expose them to this idea that like we're part of the ecosystem, we are part of ecology, they're dedicated to the education component. That's how you get people to invest in themselves.